I ain't losing my focus I was going through pain, but I'm making it go All these wounds on my body, I'ma cover and close Like it's snow on the bluff, we just keeping it rolling Everybody wanna know how I'm keeping it going I don't think it is harder to know. I've been putting my vision in work Hey gang, say gang, man We tuning back in and we checking back in another day From the toddler Before I even say all that, man It's Valentine's Day, man Happy Valentine's Day to all the beautiful women out there All the single moms Even the, the parents that's in a relationship with a man, man Happy Valentine's Day, bro You feel me? All the stuff that y'all do for y'all kids, man don't go unnoticed you feel me and i'm witnessing with my own eyes because i do have a mother uh i do have a mother and then i have my child as a mother you feel me the mother of my child she does a very 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 good job you know of working with her working with me and my schedule and it's a team thing bro it's a teamwork we we it's, it's all a team bro the foundation not gonna be strong unless the the two head top dogs is is together working together man they got that shit down packed so that's what me and c been working on a lot lately so in this vlog y'all y'all are going to be seeing a lot of sierra and kinsley man it's valentine's day and yeah bro so i'm really about to just go to the store because today bro me and c talked about it instead of me like instead of us going out and me trying to like just buy a whole lot of stuff bro we just want to spend time with kinsley and let her feel the love and stuff and let her just be around us for the day so i'm going to go to the store I'm about to get her like a little bear, probably like some rose petals and stuff and chocolate. But even though she don't, she don't even eat none of that. She don't even eat chocolate at all, bro. And y'all know Kenzie, like, I don't know if, like, if it's, like, has, I hate, I, I don't, before I say this, y'all, I don't never try to blame anything on her autism, you know. But, like, her autism is a reason why, like, she'd be, like, not zoning out, but, like, just, like, in a, um, in a narrow zone, like tunnel vision, you know. So I already know, like, whenever I go get this stuff and everything, bro, she probably not even gonna really interact with it a lot unless I try to like just handle the bear and stuff. But she really probably just gonna come in my room and probably just go straight to the TV because that's what she's so used to, you know. So yeah, man, I'm about to go to Kroger right now. I know Sierra and Kinsley is getting ready right now. I think we're gonna go to some place called the Color Factory, y'all. So man, just stay tuned for this vlog, man. I'm very excited that man, me and C is able to still work with each other and do this type of stuff for my baby because this is my heart. And it's Valentine's Day, man. Everybody deserves to be loved and stuff. So I'm about to shoot to Kroger right now. Go get the stuff, you know. Um, and yeah, man, we're going to shoot back here. Or really, I'm going to call them. No, I got to go get the stuff and really come back to the house and put it on my bed and stuff. And then go get them and bring Kenzie here, y'all. So, man, y'all going to come with me while I go do all that stuff. I'm really about to go now because it's already 2.38. Might as well 240, so we should have been left the crib, y'all. But yeah, man, stay tuned for this vlog. It's gonna be a little, little vlog, man. And yeah, we're gonna keep going. All right, game man. We just left the store. As y'all can see, man, I got little balloons and I got some roses right here. I feel bad, bro, because I'm so last minute with this, bro. And now, as a parent, now I see like why my mom always used to say, like, I used to tell me, bro, like plan ahead and get your stuff early. You feel me? Because all this ripping running around, bro. On Valentine's Day, like, I feel bad, y'all. I feel bad, and I got to get better with it. But um, I'm just glad I'm able to, I'm in a position to be able to do this and do something. Um, it's really all a part of the thought process, y'all, because at first, I was thinking, like, bro, my baby is two years old. You feel me? She already don't like a lot of shit. So at first, I was like, bro, so what should I do for her for, for, for Valentine's Day? Like, I don't want to go out and, and buy this and buy that because she's not even going to, She's not even going to, like, enjoy or play around with it because she's such, like, a baby. But I got the thinking, bro, and it's not even about that, bro. It's just the, the thought of doing it and making them feel loved, bro. You feel me? Whatever you got to do to make them feel loved. So that's what I want to do, man. Um, This, like, this, I don't know. I'm, I'm I got to stop being so hard on myself, y'all. Like, I'm so hard on myself, you know. Some people will be grateful for this, you know, and I got to think like that. You know me, y'all. I always want to go out with a big shebang and this and that, you know. And uh, yeah, bro, I do, bro. You feel me? But we gonna make it happen. And yeah, bro, I just be ho holding myself to a high standard, y'all. You feel me? But at least at the end of the day, my baby gonna get to see this stuff, you know. And hopefully, she enjoy it. But I know she gonna enjoy today. And she really gonna going to enjoy the color factory. That's really what uh, she gonna enjoy. But this stuff like this, bro, when I go sit it in my room and everything, y'all, like I already know, like she. I feel like I know my daughter. I feel like I know what she gonna do, bro. I feel like she just gonna ignore it and go right to the TV. But it's all good, though, man. It's all good. We about to make one more stop because I gotta get my baby some teddy bears or something. I just got to the crib, bro. I've been ripping and running. I've been rushing, all type of stuff, y'all. But um, this is 
I always be hard on myself, y'all, because I just be wanting to go above and beyond every single time. But at the same time, my daughter's only two years old, so there's not a lot I can do for her. So I just want to make her feel special. So, man, I just put some little rose petals on the floor with a little heart with some little rose petals. And, you know, some little toys for her. She loved toys. She loved the color pink. You feel me? And I got some stuff in there, like some bow ties, you know, um, some hair clips and little, just little stuff like that, some roses. Um, I'm probably going to give these to see y'all. I ain't going to lie because... Kenzie not going to do nothing with these. But yeah, man, I just did this for Kenzie real quick. Got some balloons. The other one over there. So, y'all, um, I'm coming to re the realization that, y'all, man, it's not about, like, how you... It's not about, like, what you do for somebody. You feel me? I feel like it's about, like, how you do it, you know? So, as long as you show showing effort, bro, as long as you show showing effort, and, bro, and you showing them that you can be trying, bro, a real female going to understand. Come on. We got to go this way. I want to show you something. I want to I want to show you something. Can I, I'm trying to I'm trying to show her something in the room, but she she don't want to go there. Okay. Where are we going? Oh wait, look. Let me let me show you something. She has to flex her little thing. Okay, okay. I ain't gonna lie, he did his thing. He did his thing. He did his thing. <laughs> Kaya, tell them if they, they not make, coming like this. They, they this. Hey, I see you. I see you doing your thing. Hey, whoever sent her this, keep doing it. You feel me? You can't go no lower than this. Hey, bro, can we get to the room so I can show you what I got you? Huh? You don't even care. You, you, can I show you what I got in the room? So you might have to grab her. Why you got your eyes closed? The room is waiting on you. Kenzie say, oh my God. <laughs> well, mess up the rose petals. <laughs> Kenzie say, oh my look, look, gosh, look at the rose petals. She went straight for the rose petals. What you looking at, mama? Kenzie, look at the rose petals. Oh my gosh. Look, look what he got you. Come on. Look at, look at the bed, baby. I'm going to pick her up and put her up. Yeah, we're going to have to pick her up. I told y'all she's going to come here and be tunnel vision. Oh my gosh, Kenzie. <laughs> look at this, Kinsley. Look, look, mama. Look at, look at this. Come on, grab the papers. Look at this. Look at this. I told, bro, I told you she wasn't going to pay attention to none of the hey, big look, stuff. Look at it, look at it. <laughs> Kinsley, say thank you. Hey, baby. All this yeah. for you, baby. Say thank you, daddy. Look at this one. Look, mama. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bro, Kinsley. she crazy. I know she ain't going to want none of that stuff. Well, pay, oh, I ain't going to say you want to pay it, no of mine. Look, mama. Look, look what I got for you. Let's figure your hair so you can have some more bows. Some, socks. some more look socks. At your hair time. You know, a lot of a lot of girl stuff, you know. Yeah. Daddy didn't know what you really wanted because you know you got a lot of toys already as it is. This is a bag for your doll. We should have brought her doll over here. I forgot. So I didn't want to double back. Hey, I didn't want to double back and just get you a lot of toys. You feel me? Yeah. Like I didn't want to just say she got enough of those. Right. I didn't want to just get her a toy and just be okay, she, she I got a toy. Sweet. That's it. Like <laughs> Look like you like the rose petals more than anything. Say thank you, Daddy. Tell her, hey, tell her your affectionate side is coming out. Okay, it's gonna get there. We're gonna get there. Do you um, see me? Yes. <laughs> yes, those are for you. Cause thank she ain't gonna do nothing with them. Because she can't she ain't gonna do nothing. Hold on, she might because she like these rose petals. She said she can have rose petals. This is mine. <laughs> <laughs> hey mama. What you what you think? She in her own yes, world. Good job. She just happy to be here. Say, you did good job. She just too happy. Say, we gonna sleep with these pillows, yeah, right? but yeah, man. Um, like I was saying before here, bro, my phone has stopped, man. It's all about just putting some effort, you know, and just making them feel loved, no matter what it is, y'all. So, uh, I knew Kenzie was gonna be tunnel vision. She's not paying the gifts. I got her no mind. She's she loving. As bad as I thought she would. Like she, she loving the rose petals more than anything. Yeah, <laughs> But yeah, man, y'all, we uh, about to, I'm about to clean up my room, pick up these rose petals, y'all, and we got to shoot somewhere that's 30 minutes away. Kenzie, if it wasn't for you, I swear I would yeah. not be leaving this house. Cause 30 minutes. 30 minutes in that traffic. Ooh. Let's go so we can hear. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so baby, I'm glad you enjoyed the rose petals. I hope you. I really hope you enjoyed those. Um, those you know those gifts I got you, those toys, the bears. 
stuffed animals, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, bro. Uh, yeah, we about to shoot out here in, in a minute, y'all. So, bro, we're going to tune back in later. I'm about to pick this room up. Hope you enjoyed it, baby. I love you. We just arrived at the crib. We just got home and everything. But we not finished, bro. We had to go. I forgot today was Valentine's Day, for real, y'all. Because we've been out driving so much. And uh, all the restaurants is packed. You feel me? All the restaurants is packed, y'all. So whenever we went there, we went to one restaurant. They said like a 30, 45 minute wait. Then we went to another one. But when I got to the second one, I seen that one was filled too. That one was packed. So I'm, I told see, I said, bro, it is Valentine's Day. All these, it's date night for everybody. Everything got, is backed up, y'all. So we got to wait an hour. And then we're going to go eat and stuff. But, uh, oh, yeah, we didn't take Kinsley to the place we were going to take her because it was just too much weird shit, y'all. And when it comes to just having my baby with me, I don't play none of them games. You feel me? I ain't taking no chances. So, basically, me and C really felt like this car was following us for real because I noticed they was behind us. And then they made the same two turns as us. Then I, they didn't put their blinker on until I put my blinker on. And then when we parked, right, me and C just like, because me and C on 10, we be watching everything. So we sitting back, we say, we, we just going to wait till they get out the car first. They never got out the car. You feel me? They never got out the car. So you know me, I just, I got my, it's crazy because I left my gun at the crib, y'all. I left my strap at the crib and I was like, damn. She was like, what? I was like, man, I forgot my strap. And she was like, man, just go get it. Go back and get it. I was just going to keep going. You feel me? I was like, man, I don't feel like going. But man, she told me to get it bro and so i came back and got it and it's crazy that like nothing happened bro you feel me but it's crazy that like i went back to go get it and we no, felt like we was in a weird happened. yeah that weird stuff bro they were su suspicious oh you want this yeah she just wants you to fill it back up that's it Bro, you was crazy. But yeah, bro. Like, so we not saying they was really following us and on that, but like it was just too weird, bro. Mm -hmm. It was too suspicious. Like, and then they never got the car. They never got the car. And then the car was tinted up. Mm -hmm. You couldn't see in the car not one time. You feel me? So yeah, bro. That's okay. why. Yeah, we don't play none of the games. Then I got my baby with me. You feel yeah, me? Sure. I'm on all yeah. ten, and I ain't taking no chances, y'all. So yeah, bro. So then we canceled that. Then we went to one restaurant. You know. Then they was two. What they say? See. Uh, a long ass we about to go get some food and she eat right now already. <laughs> she said she not waiting. Nah, I still want some food though. I still want to be Okay. <laughs> but yeah, bro. So tomorrow we're going to uh, take her to this place, y'all, so we, she can still, you know, yeah. enjoy the original plan. You feel me? Because all day, the whole day was for Kinsley. The whole day been for you, baby. Like literally. Where, where we want to go? Whole day been for you. Hold on, hold on. So that's the moral of the story, y'all, bro. When it comes to my baby or even when I buy myself, like, if I. If I expect anything suspicious or weird, bro, I'm not playing no games. So we didn't end up going in, bro. And yeah, so we here now. We're going to go get some food. In it. But tomorrow, this vlog going to keep going, y'all. Because tomorrow, we're going to really take Kinsley to the place so she can have fun and enjoy herself since she didn't get to do it today, y'all. So yeah, man. Uh, I'm probably going to tune back in with y'all tomorrow because we're going to go get some food and stuff. But never know. I might just tune back in with y'all at the place. So man, just stay tuned. Say hey, good morning to everybody. Oh, look who want me to pick her up, y'all. She wanted me to pick her up. We is tuning back in the next morning. Yes, she stayed the night with me, and we're about to finish going. Where we going? See? Where we going? We're going to the color factory today, y'all. To say, tell them this is part two. Part two. Where we going? Bro, so you want me to pick you up and then you put you down, pick you up, put you down. Like, what do you want me to do? So, look, tell them, like, every time you come over here, like, you just take over my room. Like, I don't get no TV. You feel me? Nothing. Everything is just yours. Everything is yours, baby. As y'all can see again, I got to wash. <laughs> I got to wash my sheets and stuff because of you. Because of you. Oh, yeah, bro. Uh, me and Sierra have been doing this co-parenting shit, y'all. And we've been doing it very, very well, y'all. So I'm proud of us. I'm proud of us. We we working, we working, we working. But every time I leave the room, y'all, she follow me. This is my, <laughs> my little minion. My little minion, minion, minion. I love you, baby. Tell them we need some light up in this crib right now, mama. We need some light up in this house. Look. Huh? Who? Who? For real? Hey, on the they Why didn't you tell me that I would have dropped them all? No. That, for real? That nigga not playing. Hey, T-Mobile took his bread. Uh, that's what I heard on the phone. 16? Oh. I'm about to say, what the fuck? 
<laughs> I ain't gonna lie, y'all. So the whole time Lodi was sitting on the couch right here, he was going back and forth with Team Mode. Supposedly they took his bread and he don't know why. So this nigga hopped on the bike and took off. This nigga hopped on the bike and took off, y'all. But we finished, we about to get her finished getting ready and everything, y'all. So we're gonna hit the road. We're gonna hit the road because it is time to go finish having all the fun that we were supposed to have yesterday, mama. Hey, <laughs> ain't that right? You just in a good mood. You just in a good mood. Okay, okay, okay. See how you feeling, you ready? Get this going? Absolutely. So we have arrived at the Color Factory downtown and we are about to go enjoy the Color Factory. Hey, see, can you give them like a little rundown of what the Color Factory is? Honestly, I don't know. I just know it got colors and stuff and little mini activities. It's like a ball pit. Kids are gonna like I'm, we're bringing her here because she was gonna like all these colors and LED lights and all that other stuff. Mm -hmm. It's like more of like a sensory thing I thought of for kids. That's yeah. good. And I wanted to Oh, a sensory stuff. thing. Yeah. Because yeah, she stuck at sensors. Yeah, that's what Jazz said. Jazz yeah, said. she could feel on things like the ball pit uh -huh. and like all the type of stuff that got to touch. Hey, Jazz said she liked things that like make a lot of noise and stuff too. Uh -huh. She noticed. Look at her. Yeah, she's she excited. Happy. Look at her. She's, she's too excited, y'all. Hey, look, man. This is part two, day two on on the trip that was supposed to be made yesterday oh please use the other door it says use the other door but <laughs> say i hope they ain't closed hell no we just drove all the way downtown oh come on mama come on baby yeah you get it come on oh, she's trying to get picked up but yeah bro we about to walk into the color factory y'all we about to see what it's like all right here and this is part of the color factory all right y'all as y'all can see this is a different type of room right here it's pretty loud in here y'all so hey mama <laughs> say come on come on <laughs> all right just keep it there <laughs> yes, because the music. So we are finally in a room where I can vlog and I can talk to y'all because they're playing music in every room, y'all. So we got to take advantage while we can't home. Hey, baby, why you come to get me? Go, mama. I, baby, you know I'm too big. <laughs> I'm coming. She want me to go through there with her. In every room, y'all, they playing loud music, so I can't really talk to y'all, you feel me? But shout out to C, because this is a, ain't no always. This, this is the second time that she found something like this, y'all. And I advise y'all, man, bring y'all kids here, because Kenzie been loving this, y'all. Kenzie been loving this. She been doing nothing but running around, enjoying herself. But yeah, man, this is some good quality time that we spending, bro. Some good quality time that we spending with baby Kenzie. Showing her some good co-parenting. Good co-parenting, good love in the air. <laughs> but yeah, man, I'm enjoying this. I'm, I'm, a, I'm like a big ass kid in here, y'all. I'm enjoying this. Hold on. Through rose colored glasses, looks can be deceiving. Even a beautiful rose is more than meets the eye. You hearing that? See? For every petal is a thorn, and for every given is a surprise. I'm not about to read all that, but oh, we got the, you got to look through here. Yeah, you get the, got to look through here. Hi, what, what, you, what you see? Uh oh. What do Oh, uh, everything. Wait, you gotta look at this. Look at the stuff on the walls. Maybe it's the stuff on the walls. Cause it's, it's it's something it's something that we gotta see that you put your glasses on. Like you feel me? Like it's just not like it's it gotta be something, y'all, because we have these glasses. But yeah, bro, Kenzie been enjoying this. This is another another spot. Man, yeah, bro, we've been we've been having fun with this. Look, see, so you really trying to find it? <laughs> Hey, my baby, you been enjoying yourself? I know you have, because you ain't been doing nothing but running around. 
literally, look at it. I'm just glad you enjoying yourself. All right, y'all, so I had to get this on camera every because, bro, she is slow, bro. She, How right, am I slow? She trying to figure out what, like, what, uh, like, what's the glasses for, right? Like, what we trying to look at. Basically, on the walls, as y'all can see, the drawings are there, but you can't, you can't really see them. But when you put the glasses on, you can see them better. Oh, like, that's what I was, out. I thought I was looking at that with the glasses on. <laughs> so, then, what you got? 2020 vision? I don't know. <laughs> Can you do that in the 2020 edition? No, but that's funny. Yeah, like when you put the glasses on. Oh, yeah, it defines it. Yeah, it defines it. it. You can right. actually see what they, what they, uh. Don't you try to play with me. All right, y'all. This is another room. As y'all can see, the headphones are all on the walls and stuff. They got music playing for the headphones. She listens to Beyonce. Oh, she took them right off. <laughs> Why you take them off, mama? <laughs> Y'all don't even know what I'm listening to. I'm listening to that Beyonce. Shout out to that Beehive. Don't play with Beehive. <laughs> you stupid, man. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Kinsley. But nah, bro, they playing Beyonce through these headphones right here, y'all. This is a good, this, we having a really good experience right here, man. Kinsley's really, really enjoying all it of this. It scares her. What, this? She don't want to walk on here. Oh, look, it's scaring her. Hey, y'all. It's scary. Cause she think like, she thinks she upside down or something. Come on, mama. Grab my hand. Want to grab my hand? She's scared. She's scared. My baby's scared, y'all. Come on, I'm going to get my baby off this thing. Hey, hey, hold on. Let me just make sure, like, if, if anything go down, go ahead and practice. Practice what? How are you going to be talking to me across this glass? <laughs> what you mean? I need to know if I got a real one. You know what I wanted to say? <laughs> Wait, what you gonna say? Hey, the guard, the guard stop looking. Hey, look, 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 I'm be like this. Look, the guard stop looking. Hey, y'all, man, we we joking around in here, bro. But look, this is the other station, y'all. They got different colors in here. I really advise y'all to bring y'all kids and y'all y'all friends here, bro, because we is having a good time and Kenzie's having an even better time. So. I don't know what this is, y'all, but I'm about to put these headphones on, y'all, and we about to get uh, busy, because, nigga, we is partners. Could you see that one? You see that one? Good. So it says, look, I see that you have green eyes. Yeah, oh, I got green eyes, y'all. She said I got green eyes. Yeah. What's some, uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Oh, I got the one. All right, y'all, so look, man, let me do this real quick, y'all, and I'm going to tune back in, because it's activities and stuff that we got to do. All right, so we in the little fancy elevator. Did, did you have a good time today, baby? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, yes, she no did. Kinsley. <laughs> no Kinsley. No Kinsley. I like the Hello Factory. That was good. I did good. We did good. Yeah. And then if I can go get some good food, I'm going to try See, you did a good job of picking a spot, okay? <laughs> good shit, girl. You already know this. Come on, mama. So like We're going to see y'all when we get to the next spot. Yep. All right, y'all. So, man, this is the end of the Color Factory. I ain't gonna lie, I really advise y'all to come here, bro. We had a good time, a very, very good time. Um, especially her, she likes stuff with like a lot of lights and stuff, and a lot of stuff that like triggers her. What, what's that word you said? Earlier? Sensory. Sensory. Mm -hmm. It triggers her sensors or however you said. <laughs> but uh, yeah, she had a very good time. I had a good time. She eager you know, down. Oh right? my gosh. I'm the, the grown one. You feel me? <laughs> I had a good time, y'all. So we about to go get some food and everything, y'all. About to get some drinks and stuff. Vibe out. Then head back to the house. Like I said, we were supposed to do this yesterday mm -hmm. on Valentine's Day, you know, on the day, but uh, it didn't happen. So today we had to make it up. See, I'm holding her because she ready to go. Mm -hmm. It's like, a, uh, you know, that dude that passed, the, uh, Steve Irwin? No. With the, with the red tiles and stuff? Mm -mm. All right, so it was, it's Steve Irwin. I was about to impersonate him real quick. Like, she's like a wild crop. <laughs> you know, if, I let her go, like, if I let her go, she's going to take off. She's like, he playing with you like that. <laughs> she's a wild one. Look at how she looking give too. Her, give her two seconds. Give her two seconds. Oh, she's taking you with her. She said she ain't going alone. Oh, <laughs> I told y'all, hey, give her two seconds and she will shoot. Oh. But hey, man, we had a good time, man. We about to go get some food, y'all. So just stay tuned. We had a good, good time today, man. Shout out to C, bro. She picked out the Color Factory, bro. Like I've been saying this whole vlog. If y'all been, if y'all never been to the Color Factory, I advise y'all to go. Um, and it, it gives me mixed like age differences. Like I seen adults there. Um, kids all over the place, y'all. So, couples, all type of stuff, man. So, 
We had a good time, bro. Kenzie very, 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 I said very, really, really had a good time. And she been running around all day. All, all day, y'all. And we went to go get some food and everything. She got some hookah. She got to relax and stuff. So today was a good, good little co-parent today, man. Good little co-parenting vlog, man. I'm proud of it. We going. We getting it. But we just got to the house, y'all. Like, we literally been out all day. You feel me? So we both tired. But yeah, man. Really wanted to show y'all this. This video was supposed to go up yesterday, but it was just too much going on yesterday, y'all. And so I'm about to end the vlog. I just want to let y'all know that we made it back home safe and sound. And baby Kinsley had real, real, had a real good time today. Ain't that right, mama? <laughs> but yeah, man, y'all already know what it is, bruh. If you're not a part of the family, hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all social media. And we is out. They ain't even know who, but they ain't running for me. I ain't even got lock and they keep trying to clone me. If it ain't about racks, all that postpone me. It's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely. Yeah. If it's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely.